Let's have a walk. It's not come up. Is it now? Well, shall we do where, uh, shall we see if we can find out where we are? Look where we are. Where are we? I think we've given it away again. Yeah. So, good outside uh, Casas España, estate agents. In Torrevieja at La Siesta roundabout. You've just seen the Grand China, which is just in the, I think it's in the throes of reopening again. It's just been uh, refurbished. I'm not sure if it's open yet, are you? No, I don't think it is, but somebody says next week. Next or... week? Don't it's know. one of our favourites, so we'll be going there. Now then, Brits living All in Spain. All our Brits living in Spain. <laughs> you're, you're close to us. Pop down and see us. You know where we are. Jules Hall, <laughs> hi. Right, okay, let's let's carry on, because what I want to show you today um, is this new park that's going on. A very, very exciting feature of uh, Torrevieja and this area in La Siesta and El Chaparral and St Louis. Um, it says, typical. Oh, we'll be back in half an hour. Oh. <laughs> Might miss you then. <laughs> okay, I don't think we're going to be on that long. Um, so there we go. Let's just have a walk around. We'll just turn the camera around so you can see where we're going. And you can see over the road there, there's uh, another Chinese restaurant and there's a nice garage there. And uh, this is our local bank. Sabadell. Sabadell. Just around the corner there, there's a nice restaurant, San, Re San Remo, San isn't it? San Remo, yeah. And uh, we can see there, we've got a nice view of uh, Casa de España and the fine array of properties. So moving on, we'll just show you this um, park, which is being built. And apparently this, uh, they call it a, what is it, a pump, a pump track. Pump track, it's the la according to town, the town hall, it's the largest pump track in the world. In the world? In the world? Yeah, or it will be when it's wow. finished. He's going that way, I think we're okay to cross the road. So this is it, um, you can see they've, they've already started doing the, uh, you know, the sort of design and uh, arrangement. We'll just point the camera up there a little bit for you. And it looks fantastic. Cool, I wish I were 16 again. I think they've all clocked off now because it's like siesta yeah, time. Yeah, it's siesta it? time now. This is the uh, sign which uh, tells you what's going on. All the different zones, there's patank, there's hockey, there's tennis. Uh, I think it's a little bit of football. Uh, it's an absolutely amazing thing that's going on. Fabulous for the people of uh, El Chaparral, La Siesta and uh, St Louis. It's fantastic. And uh, I'll show you what else is around here. We just had a nice coffee and tuna toast here at, um, at Mimo's, haven't we? Mino. Mino's. <laughs> Mimo. To give it the correct pronunciation. Oops. Oh, me watch. And uh, it's very cheap, isn't it, Mino? Especially for a pint. How much is it for a pint? It was in there? two, two euros for a pint. Two one, euros. One twenty per half. Two euros for a. Well, it's five hundred mil. So. Five hundred mil. Sixty-eight millilitres short of a pint, but big enough. And then we've got um, the front of San Remo's restaurant is there, and uh, a Cambello. It's a pizza restaurant, and there's a veterinary surgeon next door, next to the bank. I'll just walk across to the other side. What can we tell them about the park? It's the biggest it's, it's pump have... track in the world, but yeah. there's other things, isn't there, that's going on it's, there? It's going to be 
facilities for mountain bikes, BMX bikes, skateboards and roller skates. And it's going to be on three different levels. Yeah. There's going to be a children's level. There's going to be a, an intermediate level and a specialist advanced level. Oh, wow. And they're all going to be painted in different colours. Fantastic. So, like the juniors will follow a green or whatever it yeah. is. And so they'll know which colours. The big lads will follow a, another colour. Yeah. That's great, isn't it? There's also going to be an area for dogs. Yeah. There'll be a large central area that divides the park. There's going to be skating circuits, children's games, a skating rink. Yeah. Oh, it's big, isn't it? How, how, the whole thing is, how, how big's the whole thing? Soccer, basketball and the tank and three paddle tennis courts. Wow. The total area is 44,000 Right, Bruce and Spain meters. have just told us they're putting up another road at the top of the park for more parking. Oh, so that's interesting, yeah. yeah, that's great. And uh, here we are opposite the road there, we've got, uh, we've got another estate agent, GMG. We've got the uh, Quick Bar. And uh, there's another pharmacy there, I think. At the end, there's a rent-a-car uh, on the corner, just down there. And uh, let's swing it back round to the park, see what we can see. As I say, they've just... Uh, they've stopped working at the moment because of the, uh, the heat. From two, is two till about four, the stop, I think. I think. So, yeah. But they're really cracking on with it, aren't they? Are they? Cracking they're cracking on. Hoping to finish by summer. Wow. So. Oh, are these bikes? <laughs> they get around these yeah, bikes. Yeah, I don't, don't know where they've come from. So, I think uh, on that note, I think it's time to wrap the video up, Neil. Yeah. Have we have we gone through everything there? Yeah, I think so. So let's swing the camera around and uh, bob in there. Look. There we go, so it's a thumbs up if you've enjoyed the live stream, a thumbs down if you haven't enjoyed the live stream, please subscribe if you haven't done so already and don't forget to hit that notification bell. Three, Three two, two, one, one. Bing. Bing. Adios. Adios. <laughs>